Part 4, Auto Bowl. This is where we figure out for you what the width, or maybe I should say depth, of each segment should be in order to accomplish a wall thickness after you get the project turned. Starting here from the Layer Tuner dialog, which is a big side view picture of your project, and I'm displaying the edge-on view of the segments. And you can see by where the blue line's going, it's that we have a rather uneven wall. So I'm going to take fair care of that very neatly and very quickly by using the Auto Bowl function. It just does the, the function of dropping verticals and raising verticals from the layers to the boundary line of where the project inner or outer boundary is, and that dictates how big the segments have to be in thickness-wise. In the preferences, there's a default wall thickness for auto bowl. You can set that whatever you want. My thickness is a quarter inch. If you get here by mistake, you can click and say, no, I don't want to do that. No harm, no foul. But if you do want to do it, and you want to do a different size than your normal, say, let's make our walls a half inch thick. We can do that. There we have our walls a half inch thick. Or we can go back and do it at my default quarter inch. And there we have it that. The thinner th walls are going to have, once in a while you get a little pinching as it's where you have a change in the direction of the wall. So in this case, layer 7 has got a little bit of a pinch in it. And we will ooch up the wall thickness just a little bit. So we have a nice even wall thickness throughout the whole piece. But that, in a nutshell, is Auto Bowl.